Hey guys, it's Paul from Primitive Survival. Uh, this is the second time this knife has made an appearance on YouTube. Uh, let's see, it's a uh, it's Schrade, and it's an SCHF27. It's SCH SCHF27, and um, the knife is 11 inches overall, blade six and a half. Uh, it's kind of a lightweight. Uh, the weight is eight and a half ounces. And the steel is an 8CR13 MOV. And uh, I think that's made in China, that steel. So I'm not too familiar with it. Uh, I am not sure I really like the knife. Um, I got it. I really didn't do much with it. We're going to check it out, see how it performs. And uh, we'll go from there. And uh, it's actually brand new. Charade just came out with it. And uh, I think there was maybe one review before mine. Check it out. Okay. That's the knife overall. You know, you got some, you got a, uh, not a bad grip. It's a, it's a hard plastic. And um, you got a little bit of the, uh, what, what they call that up on top. Uh, just basically a design. Uh, that actually is a nice sharp edge for a ferro rod. I'm sure that'll work good. Scraping as well. And uh, you definitely got a nice finger choil. I do like that. I mean, you can really choke up on it. Um, and, and your thumb kind of fits right in that little notch there. But uh, there's another little pretty cool, unique thing here. Right here in the back. Just kind of pull that pull that out and you got a little tool and okay, we'll get it this way it's actually in there pretty good pull that and uh, that slides out kind of a little got a little hex got a can opener you've got a uh, gut hook for skinning and you got a little bit of a, you got a screwdriver right there and a nail pull I mean anything you want to do in as far as these to pull a nail so with that said, that fits right in there nicely. You can change that. That just kind of jerks around a little bit. You can make that smaller, shove it up there. Or you can take the whole thing out and have nothing. This way you don't have it. You just have a little hole there for a lanyard. But uh, the case, uh, the sheath, is basically, they call this, it's glass filled. You know, it's, it's almost like a Kydex, but it ain't. It's glass fold. I actually like the sheath. The sheath's not bad. The knife fits in it pretty good. I mean, uh, it sits nice. It ain't going nowhere. I mean, that's usually my test. And uh, it's it's not bad. But again, I never carried this yet on my belt. I will. But, uh, you know, I figured you guys, instead of hearing all the stuff about the steel and all that, kind of let's see what it does as far as batoning. Give it a shot. Got a couple piece of wood here. This is you're you're seeing it the first time. It goes right through the knife. I mean, goes right through the wood pretty good. Definitely. Choking up on it nicely. Oh, I like that. Yep. Fits nice with that. Oh, yeah. Now, let's see. How is that as far as scraping? Let's see if you can get in there. Oh yeah. Now see I like that. That backing actually scrapes real nice. You get some fine stuff. Oh yeah. Farrow rod would be beautiful on that. And actually that's what I should do. 
Should have bought some of the ferro rods out here. I'll make another video and uh, tell you some good, good ones and some bad ones. Not bad. As far as feather sticks, should be able to hold right on there. This ain't the wood. It's kind of wet, this wood. Well, it bites in there good, I'll tell you that. You actually almost have to back it out. It came uh, out of the box pretty sharp, too. But uh, I guess after holding it, and it does feel good. <laughs> after uh, I'll actually have to carry it a few times. And uh, we'll put it through the tests. And uh, we'll definitely uh, come back and tell you if I like it or I don't like it. For the price, you can't beat it. I mean, it retails for $39. I think it's yeah, $39.99, something like that. But uh, definitely uh, check it out. It's not bad. I, uh, it grows on you, put it that way. Okay. Well, that's a, that's a charade. And uh, hopefully you like it. I'm not. I'm not minding it now. It's. Kind of, it's. The, when I first got it out of the box, it just didn't seem like it had any heft to it or anything. Well, thanks a lot. This is full. This is Paul from Primitive Survival. Take care. Bye.